Hi everyone, Dr. Dave with Triad Health Center, and I'm joined by two of our most wonderful patients. We have Sharon and Christopher, and they are joining us today to share a little bit about their story. We have been working together since August of 2013, so six and a half year, well, my gosh, did I do my math right in that one? Yes, yeah. so six and a half years we've been together, which is just incredible that the journey and seeing you two grow together and get healthy together, we love that. So um, we wanted to come together today, so they had an opportunity to share their story. So Sharon, I'll let you kick it off. If you can tell, tell us a little bit about, you know, what originally brought you to the office. I know Christopher was dealing with some, some health issues, so tell me what was going on back six and a half years ago. Okay, so let's see. Um, at that time, well, Christopher, you know, was diagnosed with autism um, when he was around four years old. He's 17 now. Mm -hmm. And um, one of the issues we were experiencing at that time was a lot of, of course, learning issues and social issues and behavioral issues. And in speaking with his teacher at the time, I was explaining, you know, we were just talking about um, some of the challenges that he was experiencing and she suggested Dr. Dave and Triad Health Center. So that's how I found you. <laughs> and I was definitely open to, yeah. um, um, you know, an alternative way of dealing with what was going on with Christopher instead of just medications, which is fine, you know, parents who have to, you know, um, use medications, if that's the route they want to take, that's fine. But um, I just wanted a more natural approach. And in meeting with Dr. Dave and learning about not just um, the, um, the physical aspect of chiropractor, but it may even be something that can help him um, with anxieties and those kinds of issues. And that's one of the things that I've noticed the change with him is that he's less stressful. He's less stressed. And I remember we were talking about this the other day, like Christopher, when he first came in um, from the behavioral side and very understandable, just very aggressive, um, you know, very difficult to control. Mm -hmm. And um, I even remember from an adjustment perspective, you know, we really had to work together on that to make sure that he could receive his adjustment. And, and, and you know, literally what a couple of visits, you started to see his improvements. I remember maybe the first two, maybe even the first two months, it was really hard to get him on the table, get him adjusted. And then all of a sudden it was like a light bulb went off and he was so calm and he'd jump on the table yeah. and we were like, who is this kid? That was so <laughs> wonderful. And if I'm, correct me if I'm wrong, but I remember also that around that time too, he started to become a little bit more verbal mm -hmm. um, and we started to see some improvements there. Right, yeah, one of the, you know, one of the things, like I said, was the anxiety and simple things like loud noises, um, the, the uh, <clears throat> Uh, motorcycles if he would hear that that would just like you know stress him so much that it would affect his behavior and so yes so coming here and at the beginning yeah that was stressful because he didn't understand yeah. what mm -hmm. what's going what's on, going on? What the loud this? noises right. from the adjustment what's, right. yeah. what's happening but he now he enjoys it I mean he looks forward to coming and Dr. Dave taught taught you how to do what? After your adjustment, what do you do? Do. What do you say Same. after each adjustment? You give a high five, high five. and you say what? Right. Power's on? Power's on. That's what yes. Dr. Dave taught you, right? <laughs> so he looks forward to it, and now, mm -hmm. like, you, like you said, it's just very easy mm -hmm. for him to come and get adjusted. It's been an absolute honor and blessing to work with both of you, and Christopher especially, mainly because people in our community don't know that chiropractic is not only an option but vital you know vital for children um, it's vital for kids adhd and autism um, and what i love about what we do is that we're not treating autism we're not right. treating any disease in the body we're simply removing the interference um, 
that's happening from the brain to the body by taking pressure off those nerves that allows the body to express itself at a higher level and I love working with kids because you see it so much quicker right. it's like instantaneous changes sometimes so and I'm excited to continue to work with him um, we just started um, doing some detoxing yes. so now we're working with Christopher on detoxing heavy metals safely gently and already starting to see some that's right. Some improvements it's with only that. Been, it's only been a week, and I'm noticing that he's talking just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. I'm noticing it in the interactions, and I'm going, huh, okay, I'll take it. In one week. <laughs> I love it. I'm so excited to see continued results with that. Let's talk a little bit about yourself. You know, being the mom, yeah, and you know, mom. you need to be healthy and well for to take care of Christopher. So, right. tell me um, some of the, some of the changes you've seen or experienced. You know, coming uh, to care here at Triad Health Center. Yeah, well, for me, stress is a big factor, <laughs> and that was part of the reason why I started. You know, I'm looking and I'm noticing how um, uh, Christopher seemed less stressed, and I said, well. Mm -hmm. Maybe Dr. Dave can help me too because you were first working with Christopher yes, yep. and then slowly I started <laughs> <laughs> and yes I mean I you know I deal with uh, physical things at work you know where I have to help move people and help people because I'm also in the health care so I started noticing some physical stuff going on with my back but also stress and in those two areas, I've noticed that um, it has helped me. So you've done awesome. <laughs> I'm so appreciative of you bringing you know yourself and Christopher, and, and also we we focused a lot with you too, and, and making sure that you stay healthy and doing the very best that you can, given the resources and the means that you have as well. And so that's we were just talking about that where um, you know we want to let everybody know watching this that health is not a destination it's not something you necessarily attain it's a journey and we've been on a journey together for six and a half years and we're going to continue to do so and and we always talk about can we move the needle though are we moving forward are we seeing progress and so we're so grateful that you took time to share your story with us and I'm excited to see continued success for you both right. the same here and Christopher is being shy Come on. You're being shy, bit, Christopher? Yeah. Being shy. <laughs> well, you know what, Christopher? Let's get you adjusted, right? And we'll show everybody how you get adjusted and okay. how well you do, okay? So here we have Christopher, 17 Dude. years old. And uh, Christopher is diagnosed with autism at age yes. four. And then started with us. He'd been working with us for six and a half years, which if my math should be good, he'd be around 11 Oh wait, uh, yeah, about a, ten and a half. Ten and a half. Yeah. Ten and a half years old. We've been working with Christopher. When he initially came, loud noises. He was very anxious um, with the adjustments. Um, and really, within a matter of about two months, we saw a dramatic change with him. He loved coming in to get adjusted. He'd jump up on the table. And since that time, he has done amazing. So we wanted to actually show him get adjusted today. So let's do it. Okay, come okay. on over. Let's have you lay down here. Yeah. Good job, buddy. All right. Good job. Yeah, scoot you up a little bit, okay? Fantastic. Good job. Legs down, Christopher. There you go. Good. All right, let's turn that power on. Good. Just relax for it for me, buddy. Good job. There you go. Look at mom over there. Good job. There we go. Power's on. Power's on. You got it. Power's on. <laughs> <laughs> 